All right, hey there, it's Iron here, and welcome back to Dead by Daylight. We're on the Thompson house at Colwyn Farms. We have an easy daily with Freddy. Just basically got to hit four survivors in the dream state. So we're just going to get this done, chill, get our blood points, move on. So we're just taking a stroll down memory lane here, going from gen to gen, looking for some friends. Do we have any friends? Oh, there's a friend. And a swing and a miss. How did I miss that? Can I blame it on server lag? Where'd they go? Where are you at? Oh, that, that's pretty good hiding. All right, that's one hit, but that doesn't count because she wasn't in the dream state. I need to down her now to actually let it count towards my daily. Uh, let's put down a dream snare. She got quick and quiet because I heard her jump up and then didn't jump back. Let's let her go. There's a lot of banging going on here. I'm not sure why there's all this banging. Oh. Did he go through me? Is that a thing with Freddy? You can just... Or is it because I was going through the window? I mean, like, I didn't block him at all. Oh, I hear Neo over there. Hey, Dwight. Oh, and Steve. The babysitter. So that one did count because he was already glowing. So he was already in uh, state. Oh, that wasn't a very convincing, like, Fake there, buddy. But that's good. That's that's two off of him. So I've I've hit Nia, I've hit Dwight, and I've hit him twice and gotten two out of the four counted so far. What? What? What was the chase music for? I didn't see anybody. All right. Obviously somebody's here. But since I know that somebody's over at this gen, let's go ahead and go after them. Hide as long as we can. Nice. You're going to like cut back? Oh no, they took space in. They're a god. Probably not the best one, but that might help out. Alright. So that hit didn't count towards the daily. Because they weren't in the dream state. They could run. Oh, I guess I should have went through. Oh, um, I got you this time. All right, so that's three out of the four. I need one more. What are you doing? What are you doing, Steve? Oh, you saboing my hook. Where'd you go? Yeah, run up there. That, that's good. Steve, you do know that those things respawn, right? Pretty quickly. <laughs> All right. Let's uh, let's take her over here, and we'll go back and get Steve and hook him again. All right, they got one gen done so far. Oh. Steve, you got Soul Guard? Was that? Did someone pick you up or did you have Iron Will? I mean, not Iron Will, uh, Unbreakable. Oh, these guys can run, so I can't really juke them that well. Oh. So that's twice now. He always goes for the fake. Oh, Steve, you just faked yourself out there, buddy. Now, I don't know how that one missed. Your 360s are a little bit funny, but that's okay. Alright. Dwight. So... Alright, I'll just take him over here. So, it auto-locks on the... 
And he's off. That was quick. It auto locked on the hook instead of on Dwight. <laughs> did he go back? I didn't see scratch marks. Where did he go? Oh, took spacing. All right, let's go over here and punish Dwight. These guys, two saboteurs. Sabatoise. Oh, but you don't get it this time, bud. Where'd you go? Somebody's upstairs on one of my uh, chests. Get out of my stuff. Ain't ya? Yeah, not the safest way. Oh, thanks. That makes it a little bit easier for me. You just stay that well, it wouldn't have been that much harder. Alright. They gonna go get Dwight off the hook or are they gonna try to sabotage me again? Alright, we got somebody that's leaving over there. So I think we're doing pretty good. We still have uh, four gens left. We can uh, play some here. Oh! And we got Steve again. Hey, Steve. How you doing, bud? Oh, nice one. Actually, it's just bad on me, not nice on you. What you gonna do, Steve? Ah! No, bud. Doesn't work that way. All right. If they don't, uh, if they don't come try to sabotage again, we'll get one out. And then we'll look for Dwight. Dwight, you're next. Oh, I thought that was his final hook. I guess not. Alright, let's see what's going on over here. You on my totem? Oh, it's Nia again. Nia, what you doing? Hey, Nia. Ooh, she took spacing. Nice. I I thought she was going to actually try to loop me a few times. That's what most survivors would do. I, I guess these uh, PC survivors are different. Or Xbox or whatever they are. Taking spacing. By the way, we got three survivors in this game that are PS4. And one that's either, uh, and that's that one there, Dandy, is either a uh, Xbox or PC player. Okay. Alright, bud. You do realize, you, I know that you don't have borrowed time. We're going to get you out of the game now. Oh, and you didn't throw the pallet. Preserving the pallet. That's okay. Oh, look at them coming in. All right. So Dwight, Steve, and uh, Feng right there must be in a swift. For her to come in and take a hit for him like that, they got to be party together. And they're definitely, they're three PS4 players, so. Yeah, you go up there, Dwight, because guess what? I'm not going there. I am not going there. You lose. You're next, Dwight. There's Feng Min. Oh, Feng Min and Dwight up ahead. There goes Dwight. There goes Feng Min. Dwight, you can't sabotage these hooks, buddy. You can't sabotage the basement. But you can go take a, a stroll down in basement lane. You and Steve think you're funny, huh? No, 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 no. 
All right, let's get Feng Min. That'll leave Nia off there by herself. Maybe she can uh, finish up and escape, or maybe she'll come get Feng Min. This is only Feng Min's second hook, right? No, 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 no. You tell Steve too. No, 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 no. And we're gonna make sure the Nia doesn't come save you. All right, what gen is Nia working on? Are you up there, Nia? Or are you looking for Hatch? They both gave up. You over here? Oh, wait a minute. Nia's still down. You're telling me that they never went and picked Nia up? They were so concerned about their group, they didn't care. All right, Nia, if you're still over here, I'll give you Hatch. All right, you know the rules. No, you don't know the rules. But the rules is if you don't wiggle, you get Hatch. If you wiggle, you die. Okay. Hmm. Where might we find Hatch? What? Oh wait, didn't they, they they did an offering for the main building, right? Yep, there it is. Yeah, it's your lucky day. Because you're not a PS4 player. And if you guys think I'm being toxic about PS4 player, I'm a PS4 player. So no. I just want to have a really chill game and they want to be all toxic. And all I got was a ruthless killer out of that. I get a 3K and get a ruthless. And I hooked Steve three times. The other one's twice. I hooked Nia once. So I got at least eight hooks. Let's see, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, yeah. Well, that's an interesting and uh, kind of trolly toxic build. So they're both running Saboteur, they both have toolboxes, and they're running Breakout, the one they're within six meters of a carry survivor, they gain the haste uh, effect of movement speed of 7%. So that's how they could get ahead of me and then their their buddy on my shoulder gets a 20% wiggle rate, which also is why that guy got off sooner. Then on top of that, they have Unbreakable, so they can get up from the dying state. Each of them have it, so they have it once, or if they get let down and get uh, uh, picked up, they're okay. And then they have Soul Guard, so uh, that's why that one guy, once he got up, and I don't know if someone picked him up or if he used his Unbreakable that's how he was able to basically take a borrowed time hit. So that's that's a really interesting build that I had never thought about before. Um, kind of trolly, kind of toxic. Uh, definitely annoying. Uh, but anyway, it is what it is. All right, everybody. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to leave your comment, like, subscribe. And until next time, this is Iron. And we'll see ya.